Uh-huh. You wanted to try crocodile or alligator. Yeah. Whichever one wasn't endangered, whichever one the people are eating. Right, right. And, and I did a little bit of research. We're mostly alligator here in the U.S. That makes sense. Like, basically Florida. Mm-hmm. Crocodile, mostly Africa. Oh, Now, there's some crocodiles in South and Central America, mm-hmm. but we're mostly alligator here in the U.S. Right. Well, did you know, little Missy Carly Morgan... You sure do got a pretty mouth, Carla. Don't, don't you dare. <laughs> <laughs> Ugh, I hate it when you do that. Stop it. I'm sorry. I also hate it when I do that. I know. That's just gross. <laughs> it is gross. I got that from Brad Pitt in California. <laughs> also gross. Yeah. Did you know, <laughs> Lil Miss Carly Morgan, that you can get uh, turtles and frogs uh-huh. and gator? Okay. And perhaps even other uh, critters, vermin, vittles, and fixins. From the Louisiana Meat Company. Oh, really? Or Cajun Grocer. Oh, and like have it shipped up here? Yeah. Okay, that'd be kind of neat. Now, if you're a lover of alligators, you do not want to visit those stores. I would assume not. Because how they're packaged is they're skinned first, and then I think vacuum sealed and sent to you. Yeah. But um, you can get a whole gator. Wow. Yeah. Okay, so maybe we need to have like a Cajun barbecue. (laughs) I guess so. I think that'd be kind of fun. And you can get, you know, a five pound bag or 10 pound bag if you want. Wow. Okay. Huh. Now, when they say a whole gator, though, I want to know how big this gator is. Right. Because are we talking like a feed a party gator or or are we talking like baby gator? (laughs) I imagine if, yeah, if you have a luau, first you tell them how many people are coming. Right. And then they send you the appropriate sized one. I guess. I don't know. But yeah. apparently Gator is pretty good protein. Like it's lean. Uh-huh. Which I, th- I could, yeah, I could see that. And I think Gator is easier to cook or more tender than mm-hmm. Crocodile. Interesting. Okay. From what I understand. Ew, huh. gross. This whole thing is gross. It's just meat. I know. It's not that bad. I know. <laughs> I'm intrigued. We might have to look into that. Right. You know, one time when I was a kid, my mom had this big party uh, that was kind of luau style, but it was where the wild things are themed. It was really cool, actually. <laughs> okay. But she made me and my brother go out back and dig a hole to cook the pig in. Okay. So you did it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. In the hot summer sun. I think it took us like two or three days. It was like a four foot deep hole that we had to dig. It's still wow. it's still in her backyard if you ever want to see it. Okay. Now I think it's underneath the RV. <laughs> And that's where the bodies are buried. (laughs) But yeah, yeah, we had to dig this big ass hole for the for the pig to go in because we bought a whole pig. Wow. Yeah, it was really cool. Actually, put the apple in its mouth and everything. Everything. Yeah. Yeah, it turned out really rad. I gotta tell you, I was totally. I did go to. I've been to one luau in my life with the whole roasted pig, Mm -hmm. and it's really kind of gross to see. You know, like like when I eat fish, I don't want to see the eyes. Yeah, you don't want to see the head. You know. Yeah. And it was kind of gross to know that I'm about to dip my fork, but it was so delicious. I know. That's the thing. So tender. Yeah. Here's the thing. If I think Mm. about it too long, it's very upsetting. Yeah. Like, I don't like the idea of critters dying, but I also am not, I'm not so, you know, entrenched in my belief that I can become a vegan. I'm sorry. I wish I was. I'm just not, I'm a, I'm a weak person. I'm an animal lover and I'm an animal lover. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> right. Exactly. Barbecue. Mm. Yeah. 